Hello, everyone. It's Nick Hopwood, founder and president of Peak Wealth Management with another episode of Peak University. Today's topic, large bounces are normal during a bear market. This bear market began on February 19th with the former peak and a drop so far of 35% down on March 23rd. Since then, we've seen a 24% bounce this bear market balance of 24%. And if you look here on this chart, we show that the peak was February. The, the bottom part has been March. It's been only one month, minus 35% by my measure. And this chart is a few days old. This number is actually 24%. So how does that compare during past times? Let's look at the March of 2000 peak, which uh, started the bear market all the way into October of 2002, where we saw a 49% total drawdown. But before it got to that 49%, there's a 24% bear market bounce. Very similar to what we're seeing today of a 24% bounce. Now in 2007, which was the former peak, it went down a total of 56% until March of 09. But what we saw was a big drop into November of 2008, followed by this huge 27% surge in December of 2008. And everyone is feeling pretty good, feeling like, well, we made it through it and uh, now we can look forward. But in January, February, and March of 2009, right here, there was another huge decline actually going to new lows. And so, this 24%, I'm sorry, this 27% bear market bounce was just that, a short-term bounce. Now, what about now? Do we know if this 24% bounce we've had over the past few weeks is has put in the low or are we gonna see another low? We just don't know, uh, but stay tuned here to Peak University and we'll continue working through this. If you like the video, please like it, share it, and uh, learn more at peakwm.com. Thank you.